God, we get easily offended and that's what the devil does or one small thing you get you know like you get very offended you don't even want to talk or you get a level level raw raw sometimes you're just so disparate with your husband and with your wife one small thing and then you don't guard your heart your heart gets so offended uh, in Jeremiah 79, I mean, this is the creator, the creator of the universe and the creator of human being and mankind that creates you and also created us. And the creator, according to the word of God in Jeremiah 79, he said that the heart is very deceitful. And for me, I always find it interesting because it says it's too sick to be healed. <laughs> who knows? I mean, who can understand? And that's what the Bible says in Jeremiah 79, that the heart is very deceitful and too sick to be healed and who can know who may understand who can understand the motives of the heart and that's written in the bible which means the heart is very you know a vital in our approaching god mekenda menda menda garo na nelo na kwa kwa kike na proverbs 4:21 in order you need to guard your heart and how do you guard your heart and maybe you raise and say okay osa that to and i remember one of the ladies that i worked with for a few years Every time I'm asking, and then she said, oh, you're, you're not eating. He said, I'm fasting. Okay, you're not fasting. said, oh, okay, you're fasting for a, a certain days. And don't have to distract you. Don't have to worry about it. No, Uncle Ryan, I'm just fasting to have a good heart. Hallelujah. You know, people even have to fast to have a good, good heart. heart. So, your key is the heart. Not the prayer, not us, not the church, not who's praying. The condition is your heart. You need to guard your heart. Now, when I thank you, I'm going to say, I'm going to say, I'm going to say, we could you could remind you on the normal list, okay, Lord. You know, yeah, I need to get rid of this because I want my list. I want you to hear me. And that's what I do. And uh, for those of you who know me, you know me. Like if I don't like anything, I'll just come straight to you and tell you the way it is. That's that's why I do that. I need to get it out of my heart or get it out of my system. I rather clear my path with my God to hear me when I call you. Hallelujah. I I can lose you. No matter if you are offended with me and you don't like me, fine. I can lose you. But I don't want to lose the relationship with him. If you're not going to be a mother and I long, maybe you're not going to be a lot of people, but you're not going to be a lot of people. I'm not going to be a lot of people. I sit on a lot of need. You know, running different things and wanting a lot of things and waiting on him and a lot of things. My only solution is for me to clear my heart so he can hear me. And sometimes we have a lot of things we've been praying for. I mean, for years, you can already kind mind. I've been praying. He's not answering. Okay, one check system that you must do today. Check your heart. Check your it heart. can be so simple as, oh, That's your heart. You know, that's just your heart. That's your heart. And you need to clear your heart. Today will be like a you know, surgery. You need to uh, operate yourself in your heart today. In the spiritual element. You need to check your heart today. And check your heart to be good. So the Lord will, you know, um, remind you. Of places of people, and ask God to do that for you. During the process of this service today, God will lead you, but you need to desire it. You tell God, Father, I know I have, my, you know, my heart is really disturbing. I'm offended. I need you to show me because I've been praying, waiting for you to answer my prayer. But this is an obstacle. I need you to show me if there is any block or any. You know, anything that is an obstacle in my heart for you not to listen to my prayer. Hallelujah. I need you to cleanse me today. When we come and have Holy Communion, then you're coming afresh, knowing and believing that God is listening to your prayer. Look, everybody's got a list. I've got my list. He's got his list. My grandchildren's got their list. Everybody got a list. But today, we would like to pray with you in identifying some of the major lists or some of the common lists that we can pray together. But first, you need to clear your heart. Always Hallelujah. remember that. You're calling to God on your heart. You're crying to God on your heart. You are speaking to God in your heart. Come on, keep a kai kororawa. Keep a kai kororawa. You're going to say, Rudy I'm sad, but you don't feel it in your heart. And you expect yourself to cry. Or even for you to say, I am happy. You know, when you are explaining on the expression of your emotions, that's your heart. Because your heart is sad. Your heart is happy. Your heart is excited. That's your heart. And your heart is the only doorway to God. You talk to God in your heart. And Gasselem can share with us. You know, when. Uh, uh, Samuel was sent okay. uh, to anoint the, the prophet Samuel. This is Samuel chapter 16. First Samuel chapter 6. Before that, it was Samuel. Uh, it, it was Samuel chapter 15. When God was not happy with Saul, so he rejected him as king yeah. and told uh, the prophet Samuel, Go down to Bethlehem. There is a man there, his name is Jesse. Amen. Go and anoint one of his sons. <laughs> One of his sons anoint them to be 